to talk about how to find distances on the coordinate plane. Point A, located at 1 comma 4. And let's put another point down here at 3 comma negative 1. We'll call this point B. Alrighty, this is going to be at 3 comma negative 1. Alright, now the question is, how far is it from A. Well, this is a diagonal segment, so we're going to have to use a Pythagorean theorem application. Let's take a look here. To go from A to B, we are actually going to move down one, two, three, four, five steps. Okay, so we're going to go down five, and we're going to go over one, two. All right. So you see you, you formed a right triangle here. Hmm. And by George, by Jingo, the distance from A to B is actually the hypotenuse All right, on so the right Let's just go back in and take a look at our Pythagorean theorem. A squared plus B squared is always equal to C squared. Okay, well we've got two legs here of 5 and 2, so let's go ahead and put those in. Um, I'm going to put the 2 here under the A. It doesn't really matter where I put it, but I'm going to put it here. So I'll have 2 squared plus 5 squared is equal to C squared. But I don't want C squared, I just want C. So what I'm going to do is square root both sides. So if I square root c squared, I will get c. And then over here, I'm going to get the, whole, the square root of this whole side, which would be, let's see, 2 squared would be 4, plus 5 squared would be 25. So by George, by Jingo, the square root of 29 is going to be equal to c. Well, doggone it, the square root of 29 is not a nice, easy decimal. It's going to be one of those decimals that goes on and on forever and ever and ever and never repeats. It's called an irrational number. So the best we can do, if we take it under the radical, out from under the radical sign, the best we can do is approximate it. I'm going to take it out to the nearest tenth, and it's going to be 5.4. Alrighty, so there we see that the hypotenuse is just a wee bit bigger than the vertical length of the hypotenuse. Yeah, it's math mix up. Everybody, everybody's math. Gotta love the teacher. Yeah.